Here we go with AGQ, which is referred to as ProShares Ultra Silver. We have been featuring this one for a lot of days. When we started wanting to sell short, it was up around 200 or $382. And basically, when we look at today's gap, what has held the markets up were all the beaten down silvers, gold, commodity, miners, uh, industrials. That was part of giving the market some support from short-term oversold. That's the way the indexes didn't continue to co collapse and sell through. This trade here is where that gap, here's that gap, but here's where the bottoms were put in right here. So when you take a look at the bottom, this is where they shook it down and we've made all time highs for the silver and it's it's a you know it cost a lot of money but it's still relatively uh, cheap compared to where it was a couple of weeks ago silver agq breakout daily even 100 shares it's up for $15.25 here let's take a look at that level 2 agq right here Low was 179, the close was 172, so you had a $7 gap in the pre-market, and it's never looked back. Just made a high of 188.95, and it's pulling back. Uh, one thing that we will say, it's very volatile, and you got to know how to trade it. And you have to be patient with it. However, it's very cheap, so that when them silver bugs come back, this thing here has a huge move back to $250, period. End of story.